Today's game is coming to you live from Hexon, Texas at the raucous AK-47 Stadium, home of the $10 Bible beer and bullet combo meal. The crowd is armed, overzealous, and drunk, so basically a normal Sunday here in Hexon. And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. The Diami Krakens take on the Hexon Oilers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hello once again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Huh? Hey, how'd your checkup go? Well, good news, bad news. Doc says I passed my physical. Oh, that's good. And I flucked my model. Not too good. Well, I, it's 50-50. Better odds than I get in Vegas. Get a point. And it's first and ten. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. They call that the honeymoon offense. I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, turned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. Second down and ten. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. Third down and eight. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Ballsy? Stupid, maybe? I guess we'll decide after we see how this goes. But probably stupid. And the ball went in. The defense anticipated a pass there and put an end to their offensive drive. Like my wife always said, not tonight. And it's first and ten. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of Oh, he just got crushed. Oh, my God. A man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. First and ten. He is fighting for every yard. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just guineas. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for you. You know what? Never mind. First and ten. A good 
Good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the changes, Gordon. Bingo, bingo. I just hit that mutant bingo. And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. Second down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hey. Down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hey. Man, this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. First and ten. That ball was almost intercepted. Second down and ten. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And he was steering a pick six but dropped the interception. And that's why he's a defense schmuck. Second down and ten. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Third down and ten. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Well, I want Sean Kicker make a kick like this with his extra leg. He used it like a goal. Club. That wasn't a leg, you moron. That was tripod junk. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just give him the points and let's move on. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grin? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have the man at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And this guy's like a human cannonball. First down with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. I don't know if he even had a target on that throw. Second down and ten. And he's 
off to the races. He's at the... Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. First and ten. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Wham! Second down the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. did he's coming out in the field now that's the end of the first quarter and it's still anyone's game and it's first and ten oh and that one's gonna hurt he may not be able to comprehend math after that hit what's fair exactly Second and three. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And that'll bring up third and one. four more downs to punish the defense and you better believe they will the offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break they're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit and it's first and ten and that my friends was an all pro NFL hit That'll be second down and four. When defensive players go berserk, they've been known to rip the hits off of enemy players. You ever get hit in the head with a boat off rim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And it's first and ten. He delivered the 
a freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death. It was bloody and not for the meat. The Hexon Oilers got it done today. They win by forfeit. The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a feeder team should get a participation award because well, I tried really hard. Why don't you try real hard to shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the Scots, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. I'm a I'm a Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.